Thank you very much. So we have a round table, which is actually a square table. <laughs> and we have some of the most prominent people in Texas. We're in San Antonio. And we're just discussing. And I said, what can I do for you folks to create more jobs and to do all the things that they've been doing really well? Because the area is doing very well. And we start talking. And the first person gets up and said, sir, we have many people dying coming across the border because they'll come across the border. It's a vast, vast area. And they'll be dropped off and they start walking and they'll say, Houston's right down the road, but it's actually 300 miles away. And we find dead people from Guatemala, Honduras, from El Salvador, from Mexico, all over. I said, nobody ever said that. I said, well, they know it, but the press doesn't talk about it. Many, many dead people. Many. Also, they come in and raid their houses, and it's very dangerous. And they're told never to leave their house at night. And at the day, during the day, always carry a gun and know how to use it. And where they have their fences, because these are big ranches, where they have their fences, never go near the gate unless you have two people, and especially at night, and make sure both of you are carrying a weapon, a gun. And I said, nobody's ever told me this. This doesn't come out in the fake news, and this doesn't come out in the press. And these people had no idea they were going to do this, but I said, you know what? We have the media here. We have some very good people in the media here, actually. And I think it should be explained. Nobody's ever heard this. I don't think they've ever heard this.